Yeah, welcome back to Super Metroid Fusion Red Edition 5, 2, 6, something, I don't know. Anyway, uh, so power has gone completely out. Uh, we're back on the main deck. And we have to find out uh, how to get everything rocking and rolling again. So I noticed that if you were here for the uh, last video, I told you that this next section of the game is pretty hard. Actually, it's the hardest part of the game. Uh, one of the parts that makes it hard. Okay, you remember when we were last in Sector 2? I know that was, uh, I think, the very second video. Uh, you saw those things going in cocoons? Well, they're starting to hatch. And they are insanely hard. Like, they, um. Just to show you something, I'm gonna go all the way down here. Where are we at? Oh, I'm dropping all the way down. Oh, I want I want to show you how much of a fucking yeah oh saber missile work. These things hit like fucking tanks. Uh, have any up here? Uh, I, I, I think I'm going right. Oh fuck! This is space pirate. And he actually. That one actually took some fucking missile hits. Yeah, there's a right there. There we go. Yep. Oh, I thought it was going to give us like a second row. Not. Oh, I Get down there. There's a lot of sure I had to hit. Yeah. I'm not doing a good job of missing these hits. That's for sure. I'm already down on one energy thing. You gotta go all the way over here. A part that makes this area hard is like a lot of these uh, enemies at this point, I actually do a shitload of damage. And um, there's no safe uh, spots for a while because there's no power. So, I actually get my mic a little bit closer to my mouth so I sound a little bit better. And I'm coming up to a boss battle pretty uh, early, actually. I, w I will say this next boss is one of the hardest ones in the game, but fortunately, I, I know what to do here. And I hope you guys don't have arachnophobia because the next boss. It is a giant spider. Yeah, I probably could have done a few more hits in there, but yeah, best thing to do is just get in this corner here. Let it roll around. Wait for it to open its mouth. Back in the fall. Let it do what it's doing. Okay, I should open this mouth right here. Nope. Yeah, I almost pulled a trigger on that. There we go. And we're just gonna lose his legs. And the best thing to do is literally just stand at one spot. If it hits you, just take the hit and just wait for it to go over you and just shoot the missiles in his mouth. I guess this is not the quickest way of doing uh, doing this fight. But it's by far the safest, as you, you're not going to take really any hits. And we got more than enough missiles to just, you know, spare. And also, the hits are not going to be that bad. Yeah, come on, maybe I need to get back in the corner here. Yeah, this is taking a, a while here. I keep going this corner. Should only take like a couple more missiles. Oh, only one actually. Okay. Need a couple more hits. Should be good. Whoop whoop! Ah fuck. Hit should do a trick. Uh, there we go. Boom. And we got the space jump. So, um, 
We were gonna end that one video. Just have one upgrade. We're gonna get. We, we can get it now, cause now we can jump up in here like this. Samus turns into like a little mini hurricane here, and we just get on out of this area. And here's auxiliary power. Alrighty. Navigation. All right, let's talk to Adam. Hit us up. Oh yeah, I kind of forgot to point that out when we were in the main reactor room. You can see like all of the vegetation that's growing on everything. Yes, sir. We know how the thing there are certain enemies hit like a truck is uh, these guys. Mostly when I say hit like a truck, it's usually it's the flying ones that are, they are bad. And just, I usually don't like saving them in the middle of a video, but um, here we kind of need to. Because uh, there's a part here that's bad. And it, it can go wrong. So I just gotta be careful of that. Oh yeah, space jump, you can't like constantly just hold it down. You have to wait before you start descending before you can go back up. Power bomb up here. And go in this little hole and there we go. Alright, so this is the part that can go really wrong. If you can be quiet. You can hear it. The SAX is directly below us. And this is a straight up, we have got to fucking run, we can't fight it. Uh, this is by far the most stressful part of the game, and it is scary as shit. So I'm gonna be quiet and just let y'all watch. Alright, here we go. Three, two, one, and here we go. Got a screw attack too. Yeah, if if you fuck that up, that's pretty much a game over. Cause it does a shitload of damage. Okay, let me get out of here. Uh we could have gone that way, but uh, no. That power bomb. Oh, it's right here. Okay, I was aiming in the right and wrong spot. But okay. But yeah, that's the part of the game that can go south really quickly. Shit. Oh my god. Damn. Again, all the flying ones do an insane amount of damage. Oh, wait, up through here? Oh, I guess I gotta go downward. Okay. But yeah, the uh, the flying ones, like those things, they are. Ooh, yeah. You saw that one hit, I think, straight up took off like two energy tanks. Yeah, they, um. You don't wanna mess around with those. So, power bomb. I think that knock is up to 16. Alright. Here. Save room. I'm not gonna worry about it. Just. You need to be really careful. Yeah. Those things, they hit you with their stinger, man. Oh, boy. Uh, like I said, you are in a world of hurt if you get hit by one of those. I probably need to actually like start charging this a little bit more. There we go. That charge shot seemed to do the trick. That's all the way over here. There's a lot of vegetation. Can't go that way yet. It's completely overgrown. And this is the first time we've been in this area, so I don't know. Ostrom's up there, so we gotta head across.
This thing like having anyone gonna take off the fucking wings. Alright. Yeah, that gave us about full. Alright. So you remember uh the mother brain fight from uh what is it? Zero mission? Uh this is uh, extremely similar. With the little shoot missile drop you know, missile dump with the little things uh floating around. So this one's uh, a lot easier to manage. And you do got flowers that you can drop into. Yeah, uh, you don't want well, you know, there we go. You gotta jump over the beam or crouch down. Oh crap. Didn't do a good job there. And here we go, X Parasite. And this one does have a beam upgrade for us. Jump. Oh, I didn't make that one. She only took a couple more hits. Oh, there, oh, I thought that was it right there. There we go. And we got the plasma beam. Beam now pierces enemies. I will say the plasma beam is a massive step up from the way uh, wide beam. Massive step up. And this is why. Remember how hard these things were to kill? Yeah, it just annihilates these things. Yeah, I love me in the plasma beam. And you fully charge and shoot it, it looks like. I don't really see this well. I thought for sure I remember on the old Game, uh, game Boy uh, version of this game, it looked like two little missiles you were shooting out. Uh, maybe that's just my memory making me think it looked cooler than what it actually did. Uh, let's see, yeah, we don't have to we don't have to fuck with the save room, but now um, doors are now open, or doors are now working along with the elevators. And also, right to point out, we can get a pretty decent amount of upgrades. Uh, the only thing that's going to screw us over if anything is blocked behind uh, the screw attack. All right. I guess we need to go over here. There might be something over here that we can do. Yeah, plastic beam just fucking wreck shit. I fucking love it. And there should be an item over here. Power beam, uh, power bomb gun. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Energy tank. Woo! And now we start a second row. What's that, 20? I think? That we can get... I don't I don't know what's the maximum amount of energy things I've gotten in a game. I'm not too sure, except I've never gotten 100% in this, so I have no idea. Alright, let's go talk to all Powerbomb, okay. You make sure there's not anything up here hidden I can go through. Now let's just go back and talk to Adam again. I don't know why there was like this that Grand Max was floating around. But yeah, the plasma beam is just a just a just a beam upgrade. It does so much <laughs> so much damage. It's great. Oh, Adam, I, I fixed everything, and I got me a new fancy beam. How about that? I guess, yes, I did. Oh, boy, now what? Explosion in the arc data room. Great. Grow to Sector 5. I love how, like, the moment you make any sort of progress, make any sort of progress, like, hey, we did this, we did this, something horrible happens. Somewhere. This completely falls the fucking apart. Alright, I don't know. What's, what's going on in Sector 5 that we need to worry about? But yeah, how I said, like, 
you know, this part is the hardest part. And really, what we just did, the power uh, plasma beam helps out immensely. So, all right, what we got? And the nightmare. <laughs> There's a nightmare to deal with. That's what we call it, that hoss. Military applications. Manipulate gravity. Become an ex host. So, you know that thing we saw floating in the background a couple of videos ago? This is that. Destroys the entire station. Well, the, 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 they're, uh, they're uh, pretty damn reckless, ain't they? They just like this. Just fuck everything. All right, so go over here, and yeah, it's already made a mess. Let's see what we got here. Um, okay, that was oddly very easy to get. Ooh, speed booster. Hmm, okay. Oh, we have the ability to get over there. Okay, here we go. Ah, shit, the door closed on me. I say, how, how late does that door stay open? Okay. Okay, I'm going to zoom across here. Boom! Hey, look, power bomb! Yay! Uh, so that'll move us up to 18. Let's see, make sure there ain't nothing hiding in here, is there? No, there's not. Okay, that was it. Uh, let's see, there's anything over here. I love how the power bomb just takes the place over the. Uh, <laughs> The X-ray visor on basically everything. I wonder that's something that's why they give you so many power bombs is to do something like that because they realize they don't they don't have the other stuff for you and that's why they do that. That seems like that would make the most amount of sense to me. Hey, that was a red door we can now go through. What's over here? Oh, sector three. All right, there's like these little sections in the game where they get connected to each other. Let's see, can I get... Oh, oh. Power bomb out here. Does that, they're not putting that me out in space or I'm just crazy. But there's little parts out here. I think every section has it where the next part is connected to another part for like a little hidden area. I can hide the charge beam doesn't anything on that. I guess we're going down. Oh no, water. Let's see, can I get in here? What's in here? Wait, nothing? Oh, shit, we'll come back there later. Oh, ain't nothing too terribly important. Shit, I'm like, oh my god, they turned into fucking fish? <laughs> Seriously? That's kind of fucking weird. Damn, anyway, I fucking... I don't think uh, a lot of hits. And being underwater absolutely sucks. Yeah, yeah. Spam them full of missiles, that's for sure. Yeah, give me the fuck out of water, please. I'm not 
doing a good job right now. I'm being like really fucking clumsy. Parabomb. I'll grab that. I think that'll knock me up to 20. Oh, there we go. Full energy, okay. Yeah, we, uh, we like our red ones, that's for sure. Alright, here's our boss room. Yeah, I'm gonna, yeah, it's gonna be a nightmare. It's gonna be in here. And let's see. Ooh, energy tank. Yeah, you know, as, as reckless I play this game, I definitely need it. And here we go. Hey, look, it's the scariest boss in all of Metroid. This thing right here. Hey, yeah, our screw attack ain't really gonna work either, so. Not screw attack, it's high jump, because it's gonna. Well, it works right now, but it's gonna turn on the gravity here in a second. So, uh, the weak point is the little uh, gravity projector underneath of it. Jump up high, like come down. A couple more hits. Oop, that didn't do anything. There we go. And now we got gravity going on. Now our space jump doesn't work. And everything moves in slow motion. And its eyes are leaking. Yeah, that's what we want to see. Oh my god, it feels like I took so many fucking drugs. Like I took a dip of acid right before this match, this fight started. Oh my god. And that stopped getting hit. That'd be nice. Fortunately, it doesn't do a whole lot of damage. Alright. And wait for the mask to come off. And oh my god, what the hell is that thing? Oh my god, what's wrong with your face? Oh shit, I'm like stuck in a corner here. <laughs> Watch wrong with your face. This <laughs> is fucking melting. It's falling out. Why even room is? Uh, what room am I even in? It's like there's just a bunch of spare parts in here. It's like a warehouse in the background. Yay, we did it. And we got the gravity suit. Yay, we got moving water. Hey, look, our suit actually looks kind of cool now. Woo! Alright, so that's the speed booster block. Again, now that I have the... Uh, not even like a wall or just it's like an invisible wall. How strange. We boost our way through there. There we go. And get the time to get the fuck out of this area. I know where there was an item what down yeah, all the way down there. I think there was an item down there. But yeah, water doesn't do anything and a lava actually doesn't do anything to me anymore either. So that's uh, actually pretty nice. Okay, let's go right past them. Yeah, I'm assuming there's something right there. It's just the way it's lined up. Oh, it's a missile. Oh, okay, actually. Pretty good shot, actually. Oh, 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 oh. And uh, yeah, we can't use a power bomb here because if I remember correctly, it'll block it off. See here, I'm pretty sure it like does something where it shows y'all him blocks. Yep, there we go. 
it intentionally will chop you off there from doing that. Okay, now we can go this way. What's the speed booster? Yeah, speed booster. Oh, okay. It's crazy how much smarter I am at Metroid when I play a Metroid game that I know what I'm doing in comparison to Dread, where I'm like, Dude, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm dumb. But no, here I am. I have a partial brain. There's a partial brain, not much of one. Oh my god, look how cool that was, bro. Actually, I think there's something down here for me. That's a screw attack. Ooh. Okay, there's anything over here. Red door I can't get through. Okay, hopefully those things is not... Okay, yeah, those have not come back yet. Okay, good. Yeah, so this is uh, technically the section of the ship that you're not supposed to be in. Is this hidden behind a bunch of like red doors? I can uh, you know, figure out how to fucking jump. That'd be great. I got power bombing. When in doubt, power bombing out. That's gonna be the strategy. <laughs> I just want the missile, bro. Just let me have it, please. Alright. Yeah. So, uh, you know how I said I was kind of getting burned out on Metroid a little bit? Um, I still think this is going to be my last Metroid game for a while. Ooh, that's a big old fish. I do think what I'm going to do next is I'm going to do the uh, Road to Glory thing on uh, the new college football game. Because I really enjoyed it in uh, NCAA 14. And I really, really hope it's just as good on here as it was in that one. I'd be disappointed if it wasn't. Oh, we got some fucking goobers here. Aren't, isn't that like a Super Metroid boss? Area. Okay. Over here should be an item. I'll be surprised if there's not. Oh, I know what it is. It's, uh, we gotta use the speed booster in this section. Okay. Okay, let's see how this goes. Wait, really? Is there not a speed booster section in here? But it was acting like there was. Well, that was how kind of weird. Oh, what the fuck am I shooting at? You know, I don't hell. I don't know. Should be an item in here. That's where's this take us to? Nowhere. Okay. No. Oh, here we go. Gotta yeah, make our way for this little maze. Actually, I think we need to go. Over, if I'm, if I'm correct. I just bounced my way into everything. Hey, look! Security room for sector for, uh, number four. So now all latches are now open. I don't know what the purpose of those things are in there. I have no idea. Is there a way downward here? No? Okay. I thought there was. I swear I thought there was an item in there. Maybe there's not, or maybe it's in a different room. Oh, it's this room. Oh, okay. 
Oh my god, I hate the- oh my god, these annoying ass little bastards. Here we go. Yeah, I am right down there, as I am currently locked and getting hit. Ah, shit, I'm just gonna have to missile my way out everything in here. Fuck it, fuck it, missiles for everyone. Ah, you- ah, I hate- I hate you. I hate you. Can I, like, my aim is beyond terrible. This has lost five energy tanks by me, me by, you know, being stupid. What the f oh my god, I, I, I feel like I'm drunk. How did I jump? How, how do I do any of this? Yeah, just make sure I'm not missing anything that's hiding here. I'm not grabbing on any ledges, so I guess there's that room is a nothing burger. What about in here? Anything in here? No. Okay. Save room, we don't worry about that right now at the moment. And I don't know what the hell those little... What the hell these things are supposed to be. I don't even know if they know where they're supposed to be. Yeah, we'll, we'll just take the hit so we just get into the next area as quickly as possible. Can't get up there. Well, looks like I can't go there either. Do I need to head back? Is there a door underneath of me? Speed booster. Oh, okay. I gotta head back. Kill this shell cone thing. I don't know what it is. Get the speed booster build up and whammo. It's like the most kind of little way of getting anywhere. Alright, we got a regular, um... Oh, that's it. Sector, um... Come on, make that hit. There we go. Sector 4 music back. What's that? Power bomb? Oh, missile. Um, not gonna be able to get that one. You have a comment on a download room, though. With an item that's gonna take care of that problem for us. Open up that door and we have a download room. What do we have? Oh, it's the def diffusion added to missiles. R Charge with R and fire with B. And you're wondering, what exactly does this do? Well, it does this. It does that, so. So, there's a couple items over here I think we can get now. It's, uh, take the long way over here. Does that open those up? It does. Is that just a spot that's to show it off? It fucking looks like it. Hmm. Well, that seemed kind of pointless. Come on, I just want to speed boost from my way through here. Stop shooting me. I'm trying to do this quick. Oh, wait, uh... Oh, I guess I gotta go back there away. My bad. <laughs> oh. Ah, that, well, this is annoying. Yeah, 
Is there, was there nothing in that room at all? I'm actually uh, getting kind of low on energy. I gotta. I mean, we're almost done here. I just gotta be a little bit more uh, careful here. Okay, I don't. You know, let's see. Power bomb. Let's see what we got in here. Where is it at? Oh, okay, I see it. Okay. <laughs> Get myself zapped for good measure. Alright. Oh, well, that was, uh, I think this will be the end of this video here as I get all my energy back. Missiles, power bombs. I'd like to thank y'all for watching, and uh, we will see y'all in the next episode. Uh, I will say this we are getting very close to the end. There's not a whole lot left. I think we probably got only got like three more videos after this. Yeah, this game's pretty short. So, anyway, thank y'all for watching, and we'll see y'all next time. <gasps> Boy.